Hi, I'm Victoria for CBMania.com. We're here at the New York Comic Con with Darth Vader. Hi, how are you? How are you? Good. Did you just get here? Are you enjoying yourself? Yes, I just got here. Okay, where are you from? Illinois. Say that again. Illinois. Okay. Illinois. Darth Vader is from Illinois, for, for those of you who didn't know. Um, are you here? Are you here with a group? With the 501st Legion? The 501st Legion? I can't hear with Darth Vader. The 501st Legion? The 501st Legion. Is that correct? Yes. All right. Well, you look mighty fine, Darth Vader. Thank you. <laughs> I'm here with Eric Powell, the writer and artist for The Goon. Tell us a little more about the character and how the how he came about. Okay. Uh, this is a comic I've been doing for uh, 10 years now. It's uh, uh, published by Dark Horse Comics. Um, it's basically kind of a dark comedy about this street thug in a world of monsters. It's kind of... Uh, goes anywhere from being very dramatic to not very serious at all. So. Okay. And how do you see, what what do you see happening with a character in the next year or year? Um, that's a good question. <laughs> uh, I, I Probably a lot more of the same. A lot of uh, uh, unexpected uh, quirky stories that uh, will hopefully keep people entertained and, and uh, guessing as to what I'm going to do next. Tell us about the new film coming out. I know you can't tell us yeah. that much. Well, uh, it's been optioned for a, a film by uh, David Fincher, uh, Blur Animation, and Dark Horse uh, Entertainment. Um, I'll, I'll be working on the screenplay, and uh, um, I've seen some test animation. It looks amazing. And I'm very confident that if we get this thing made, it, it will uh, uh, be visually spectacular. And uh, uh, it doesn't hurt that the producer just got 13 Oscar nominations, so that works too. <laughs> okay. And what's yeah. the basic the storyline for the film? Uh, we're taking uh, a lot of the material from the comic and uh, condensing it. I'm working really closely with the producers and uh, Making it work in a format that will that will uh, uh, really get the the weirdness and the quirkiness across in a film. Yeah. Eric, what are some of your inspirations? How did you start? Uh, when did you start drawing and writing? Uh, I don't really remember a time when I, I wasn't uh, writing. I was a small kid. That's my basically my earliest memory was uh, sitting in my grandmother's floor and. and drawing you know comic books and, and things so uh, it's been my whole life uh, art and, and illustration and making up stories um, so it's 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 always been in me to, to do this kind of thing what are your top three favorite comic books of all time uh, probably Mike Mignola's Hellboy Jeff Smith's Bone and uh, Will Eisner's Spirit those are my, my top three. Yeah. Can you give us some tips, you know, people who are trying to get into the industry? Uh, you have to work really hard and not give up and draw every day, no matter what. Keep uh, perfecting your skills and, uh, and be persistent. And, you know, if you have the, the natural ability and talent, you'll, you'll make it one day. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate it. This is your CB Mania Anime Minute. Time to try out Kensei's technique. It's breaking. I'll kill you. I mean it. You're dead. This is goodbye, kid. It's so slow. He's too angry to focus. I can stop it. Compared to Apatai's punches, it's not even moving. I've got it. His balance is off. His center of gravity is completely open. This is nothing. After Rokisame Sensei's training and all those statues, I can barely feel him. He's as light as a feather. I, I won. Are you okay? Uh, his pulse is steady. I was worried I killed him. What? He's more concerned about the guy that tried to kill him than he is about himself. What a funny guy. <laughs> what? Why are you laughing? Did I say something weird? <laughs>
now being released by Funimation. And this has been your CB Mania Anime Minute. I'm Vittoria for CBMania.com, here with Eric Knopsinger, creator of Conduit, and Mark Shepard, basically the lead character in Conduit. Eric, how long did it take you to develop this game? Well, it's been, uh, it's been a, a little over a year and a half that we've been working on it, and we've got a few more months before we ship. Uh, but really, we like to say that this is, uh, this is a game that's been uh, 16 years in the making for us because we've been making games for that long, and this is really the game we've been uh, building up to this point to make. Mark, tell us about the game and your character. Well, the, as far as I'm concerned, the game is uh, the best first-person shooter that's been made for the Wii. As a, as a Wii owner, I've been waiting for a game like this so I don't have to you know, play my three-year-old's games anymore. And uh, I'm really, really excited by it. These, I, I know some of the people are high voltage, and quite early on they said, would you be interested in doing this? And I don't do a lot of games. And I said, you know, let me know what the story is. And they told me what the story was. And uh, it's, it's pretty deep and it's pretty interesting. And uh, it's a lot of fun to do. It's a lot of fun to play. When can we expect the game out? Summer of 09. So get your pre-orders in now. And what software is it for? Uh, it's exclusively for the Wii, so this is this is definitely uh, not your casual uh, shovelware title. This is a high quality AAA title exclusively for the Wii. It's just really nice to be associated with something that's just such a quality product. I mean, there's a lot of disappointments in the game world, and it's nice to be associated with something that really delivers on a platform which people just don't expect. They don't expect to be to be given this much scope on a platform that most people don't take quite as seriously as some of the other gaming platforms out there and it's great to see. I say go buy it, go play it. It's a great thing to do out this summer. Thank you so much guys.